What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. I'm probably peeking the shit out of my mic right now. If you haven't seen yesterday's video, go check that out. It'll be in the top right hand corner if you click on the card there. It works on mobile or on PC. So, uh, today we got some news, a lot of news. Um, I'm going to give you some helpful advice and also uh, a lot of information today. We just got a bunch of it dumped on top of us. Let's get into this video. All right, our first little bit of news is that the release for this Friday tomorrow is actually been announced. I guess Elena's back from vacation. Good, just in time. Uh, I'll be talking more about this event later on in this episode of the news, but it looks very nice. It's a continuation on last year's birthday event for Arnix. Ar Ar not Arnix, Arnix, Ar Ar Arnix, I don't, A-R-A-N-X, it's in the background, you can see it right there, that's his name, he's an artist for Adventure Quest. Alright, so, we also got the information that you need to complete the previous release to do the current release, the one that's coming out tomorrow, um, so if you copy this, you go into Adventure Quest, you type in slash join, and then copy that and take the space out of it should bring you to the event there we go so it's just called slash join celestial realm um i've already completed it you've already completed it if you wanted to get the um well maybe you didn't maybe you could just go to the boss but here is also where you get the burning blade uh the burning blade version 2 arnix wanted to make um why do i call him arnix i i don't know if that's his name but the artist i'll refer to him as the artist wanted to make it uh but it wasn't uh, I don't think he could or he got he wasn't approved to make it or something like that So there was no burning blade v2. There's the actual original burning blade there <laughs> Thanks uh, for showing that so you can get that which is 15% more damage to every mob in the game uh, It doesn't do more PP damage though So it's a very good weapon if you want to get that and that is at this location So I'd recommend playing through it so you can play tomorrow's release all right, along with tomorrow's release, this is an armor confirmed, uh, not confirmed, but it says Celestial Round V2, which is tomorrow's release, uh, hype. And then he shows this armor, which I have never seen in game before, so I would guess, this is a guess, probably a pretty educated guess, that it's going to come out tomorrow. So that is very, very interesting. Oh yeah, here's a post I found. Uh, we won't be making a Burning Blade version 2, sadly I just don't have the time to create it, so it wasn't because he wasn't allowed, it's just because he doesn't have enough time, which is understandable. Now this, this is where, this is where I got all my hype from. So, we discussed this a great deal. We do want to make a class like this. Uh, they're referring to Evolve Light Caster class. Uh, but not until we're done the server rewrite. Uh, once this is done, we will be able to introduce a new very cool abilities and something a class like this should have. Capitals on the should, capitals on the do, capitals on the very, on um, very cool uh, for abilities. We may release maze in all capitals because I, I guessing it's up in the air whether or not they're releasing the armor tomorrow. Um, I would guess they they are because it's already in game. We have in game screenshots and I already have uh, it's been appearing on people's character pages. So I would speculate that it's coming out tomorrow. Plus uh, they'll be making a lot of money off the ACs because they currently had an AC sale, uh, which they're still advertising as I know it's, but from what I can tell, it's not currently active in game anymore. Um, if anyone buys ACs in the next uh, day or two, uh, please tell me if you get bonus ones. Uh, but on the when you go to purchase ACs, it doesn't say there's a bonus, but this post is still up. They didn't remove the post, so I don't know if that's still an active thing. I guess it's not because they don't advertise it when you're buying the ACs anymore. Um, so we may release the Evolve Lightcaster armor this weekend. If we do, anyone who buys it will automatically unlock the Evolve Lightcaster class when or if it's created. That's awesome. So if they do release the armor, it'll probably be 2,000 adventure coins. That would be my guess price for the armor, but you will be getting the armor and the class. So you won't have to spend extra ACs on the armor. Uh, because they've done this for uh, the Dark Caster, the Arcane Dark Caster. If you bought uh, one of the armors, there was two different armors you could buy for ACs. You could buy the normal 2000 AC armor. Was it 2000 ACs? It cost like, it might have been cheaper or something. I don't know, but you could buy the armor and then that would give you the class when, it, when the class unlocked. Uh, but there's two different armors to buy. So they've done that before where uh, you just 
like if you have the armor you can do a quest and it's like a really fast quest and then you'll get a merge item but you need the armor to do that quest so if you buy the armor you can merge and get the class but you still get to keep the original armor that's how it worked last time so it might work like that again this time hopefully i explained that right okay so that basically means you're buying the I would have bought the armor anyway, even if it was 2000 ACs and it didn't come with a class, I would have bought the Evolve Lightcaster armor anyway. Keep in mind that there's two versions of the Evolve Lightcaster armor. Um, I don't know if one's going to be cheaper than the other, or I don't know how they're going to do that if they're both 2000 ACs. Hopefully, if you buy it early, like they can sell it to you for like 1600 ACs. I don't, I don't know. I guess then they're, they're selling the class for 1600. It, uh, if both of them, if I have to spend 4,000 ACs to get both armors, that's going to be kind of not not the greatest. Maybe if you buy one, you get a discount. I don't, I don't, I don't know how they're going to do it, but it's kind of kind of worrying that there's going to be two variations of the armor. But if you buy a variation of the armor, you're going to get the class, but they're both going to be 2,000 ACs. Well, I'm guessing they're going to be 2,000 ACs. Maybe you get a discount if you buy um, before the class comes out. Maybe that's the thing. That'd be cool actually because then you're investing in a class that you don't know is good or not although they do say that it's gonna have very cool abilities which sounds like it's gonna be a good class and i'm gonna get the class and the armors either way so let's move on to the next topic all right this picture is so large it doesn't fit my recording box we have the female version of the new navel that's coming out soon Sorry, I had to take a second to think of what the navel was called. The Cursed Navel. That's, of course, what it's called. Um, I'm going to move my window so it's going to look weird. Boop. Um, that's what the male version looks like right there. And then we have the female version right here, along with a bunch of different helmets, hairstyles, and different uh, variations on it. So, um, what I can tell from this is that... So, these helmets, there's nothing covering the armor. This helmet, there is something covering the armor. So, that would lead me to believe that the uh there's no gonna there's not gonna be a variation on the armor it's gonna be a helmet that adds that a cloak or whatever that is i don't think that'd be a cloak like a shoulder i don't i don't know what they call that but we also have an anchor weapon i saw someone suggest this on twitter and dave said it would be done so there it is there's an anchor weapon a pistol blade another pistol oh no that's a that's a dual wheel so it's like a dagger with a pistol and a blade which is very cool i love that pirate pistol blade and if you look at the hilt of this uh there's also a pistol on the uh as the uh, grip in the hilt right there so that's very interesting and these blades i'll show you more about these blades these are fully animated well not fully animated but animated blades uh they have an animated particle effect kind of like the ungodly reavers very cool um this also confirms the um cape a uh, gun cape and then we have the mouth blade also right there so a bunch of cool things including the female version right there here is another look at it uh just a different look i guess but more of the same i honestly like the male version of the armor better than the female version i don't get why if Dage is watching this maybe he is uh maybe i don't know but i don't get why it's red here and then for the female version, the same piece of clothing is uh, gray, uh, like the pants. Like, why isn't this gray on the male or this red on the... Why isn't that red on the female? It'd look a lot nicer if that was red on the female. And I wonder if this hair isn't color custom because it's red in all the pictures. Maybe it is. Uh, and Dej just has his hair set to red to show it off. But I don't know. Uh, it's kind of kind of weird why that's red and that's not. That's my opinion on that. Let's move on to the next piece of news. Okay, this is actually the last piece I have for today. This is the animation on those blades I told you about before. That's the animation. I uh, just thought I'd show you that. It's pretty interesting. I, the blades don't have any textures on them. Uh, maybe they will in the future. I Maybe that's a reference to something in the event or something. It doesn't really make any sense that there's no texture on it. It'd be cool if he made a blade uh, that had like the same color. So it was like a, maybe like a... Uh, uh, like a, what is that like an orangish orangish uh, brown color on the base of the blade with like black accents all over the place to match the uh, the armor a little bit that'd be cool if they made blades like that for the event and added that animation to it that'd be thick but guys thanks for watching the news video for today hopefully you enjoyed it remember to play through this event so you're ready for tomorrow's event when that comes out make sure you come to celestial realm and play through this event so you can do tomorrow's event. Thanks for watching again. Leave a like if you enjoy, guys. Comment down below your thoughts 
Are you going to be buying the Evolved Lightcaster now that you know that you, you may or may not get a class if you purchase it? I know that incentivizes, incentivizes me a lot more to buy the class than it did before. Or not to buy the class, the armor. The armor. I misspoke. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace. Click the video in the top right corner if you haven't seen it yet. And I'll see you all in the next one.